What's up guys? Short video today. I wasn't gonna make a video today, but I wanted to show off this design that I got working. I know was talk I've talked about this in the past, uh, but this is the full print in place uh, butterfly knife that I've been working on for a little while now, kind of a background project. Um, I'm waiting for a bunch more filament to ship for the printers. So I'm using this garbage, like actual white uh, ABS and it's just kind of killing my vibes when it comes to designing stuff right now because I don't really want to print because it's supposed to look like this. But uh, long story short, the idea is to get one that operates something similar to that uh, but all print in place in one piece. And I'll, I'll shove the clip in right now of uh, pulling this one off the actual printer. The coolest part is these hinges on this one, and it's gonna be hard to show on camera, so I'm gonna cut in the cat as well. But the hinges on this one are all print in place, so the knife itself can be printed in one location from the printer, uh, and then just flicked open and, and brought out. Now there's gonna be a bunch, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of tuning that's gonna have to take place when it comes to getting this to spin nice and smooth. It still doesn't really flick or spin very good or even close to a real one. I mean, they're both they're both kind of close, but uh, this is just something I really I really like and uh, I enjoy printing because I wanted to get something that I can print in one go and then just be like, here you go, here's one, uh, have fun. You can't hurt yourself with a plastic one. Um, but yeah, that's about it. I wanted to give you guys a quick update on the life. Uh, I've also been following the the ballast scissors thing for a while, and the first auction was this week. I wish I could do that, but I, I put a comment. I want to try to print a pair of those, but um, yeah. And if you don't know what that is, uh, then you probably don't play with butterfly knives because it's like the rave of butterfly knives and it has been for a while. This guy's been building these ballasts or things, long story. But I wanted to make sure I got a video out to you guys um, this week. This week was a little slow for me, but um we're getting back up to speed with some of the other stuff and I'm going to be moving. So I have to, ah, like the fifth move in like, I don't know how long, but the lab is going to get reset up. So let me, let me do this as a, a chance to get a snapshot of the lab, uh, in, in time and space for right now, at least we'll turn the lights on. This is the current lab. It is an absolute mess, but might as well get a quick, a quick snapshot of it just in case I forget to do this later when I'm, when I'm going. But yeah, that's, that's about it. That's about it for today. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, as always, uh, I'm making videos every weekend, so right now we're still on the weekend schedule, so that's, that's all going good. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and that's pretty much it. I will see you guys next time. Hopefully next time uh, we'll have uh, we'll have a printing place butterfly knife that's a little bit smoother that I can uh, give to everyone. I still will probably share this file um, for the first iterations of this, but this is definitely not the final version. I want a version that's a lot more, I guess it just like the, the joints uh, uh, spin a little more, but these joints like so this is this is also let me let me give a little bit of the sauce of why this one's actually pretty cool And this took even a while to figure out these joints are fairly strong and for print in place joints um, That's not really something that that comes with the territory normally now There's a bunch of different ways to do print in place, but this is just a very specific one that I designed myself So yeah, um, but now I can put joints on anything not not only just handles for knives But now I can put this cool print in place joint on anything I want now and it's it's really good, it's really nice and smooth action, and it holds the position that it's going in. But, I don't know, that's that's about it for this week. I wanna make sure I keep you guys up to date. Uh, but that's about it, hope you enjoyed, and more coming soon. Thank you guys, bye guys.